Many plastic materials will burn when ignited, and depending on their combustible nature, they can potentially be quite dangerous given their application. The UL94 flammability rating for plastics provides a relative indication of a plastic's acceptability for use as part of a device or appliance concerning its flammability. The Underwriters Laboratory's UL94 testing includes several different burn tests used to classify materials including both horizontal burn and vertical burn testing. The UL standard classifies plastics according to a minimum thickness at which samples stop burning when tested in either the horizontal or vertical orientation. Therefore, UL94 test results should always be provided along with a tested thickness. The UL94 testing calls for specimens to be subjected to a specified flame exposure. The relative ability to continue burning after the flame is removed is the basis for classification. More favorable ratings are for materials that extinguish themselves rapidly and do not drip flaming particles. Most materials are tested for UL94 HB horizontal burn and for V vertical burn testing, which is a bit more stringent than the HB testing. In the UL94 testing, the samples are positioned either horizontally or vertically and then exposed to a flame for 10 seconds. After removal of the flame, the burn rate and the characteristics are examined. Materials with higher burn rates typically are classified as HB, while more flame retardant materials earn one of the V ratings. Let's review the ratings. An HB rating is given to a material that experiences a slow burn on the horizontal test. A V2 rating is given for materials that stop burning within 30 seconds on the vertical and does allow for flaming drips. A V1 rating is given for materials that stop burning within 30 seconds on the vertical and allows for drips so long as they are not in flames. A V0 rating is given for materials that stop burning within 10 seconds on the vertical and allows for drips not in flames. A 5VB rating indicates that burning stops within 60 seconds on the vertical with no drips and the test specimen may exhibit a burn through hole. Finally, a 5VA rating indicates that burning stops within 60 seconds on the vertical with no drips. However, no burn through hole is allowed. As previously mentioned, the thickness of the test sample does matter. Typically, thicker test samples result in better ratings compared to thinner ones. When a material has been tested and recognized by UL, it receives a UL yellow card designation which details its test results. Some material suppliers simply provide flammability estimates. A material supplier should be able to provide a material's UL yellow card designation if it has been tested and passes UL standards. Contact Bedecker Plastics technical team if you need help obtaining UL information for a particular plastic or for assistance with material selection. Please feel free to add your comments below, like and share this video if you found it helpful, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.